Hey everyone, welcome back to another Stickbot Kids movie. You join us today, and not just the end of the year, but it's the end of the entire decade! Woohoo! And in today's video, we're going to be going through all sorts of things from a history of Stickbot Kids movies and an exclusive interview with two guests. But first, let's take a look back at the highlights of 2019. Okay, so, now that we've taken a look back at what's already happened here at Stickbot Kids Movies, what's going to happen in the future? Well, one thing I wanted to do would be a cool Clickbot movie where there are four Stickbots and they get turned into Clickbots um, and they get teleported to this magical new world um, and they have to save this world and defeat the evil Modulus to turn back into Stickbots and get back to their homeland. Um, I just thought it'd be a cool movie to make with Clickbots. Also, though, now that Monsters has officially ended, <laughs> I thought we should, like, do another series, um, maybe a prequel or a sequel, or even one where they talk. That would be cool. Anyway, those are just two ideas of what we wanted to do in the future. But now it's time for the moment we've all been waiting for. Ladies and gentlemen, put your hands together for the Monsters cast and director! I so love this job. Thank you very much for coming, it's nice to have you here. Good to be here, Stickbot. So, I mentioned to the viewers earlier about another monster series. If you were to make one, what would you have in mind? Well. I would prefer to make a prequel series to give kind of a backstory to the original series, like how it all started and how the monsters ended up taking over the world. Sounds pretty good, I'm sure the viewers would love to watch that. Now, in the original series Red dies in episode 5, is there a specific reason behind this, or is it just random? Well, we didn't want a cheesy ending for monsters, so one of these three had to die, but we didn't want the main character to die, and we didn't want the girl to die either, because there was supposed to be some kind of romance, so Red ended up being the only one left, unfortunately for him. Okay, so, as we've already discussed, monsters is ending now, so will there ever be any references in other animations? 
Well, we've already referenced in one animation that we've already done, the um, best Stigbot Central series, um, but we're planning to do references in tons of them because this one is the, probably the most popular. Um, we liked this one quite a lot, so there's going to be a lot more references as well as a lot more series if the viewers are up for it, um, if they vote for it in like a poll. Okay, so one last thing before you go. Would it be okay if you guys did some kind of exclusive battle scene thing, you know, just for the viewers, an exclusive New Year's treat? Well, we could. Let's get out of here then. <laughs> was impressive. Ladies and gentlemen, the Monsters cast and director! Thank you for coming, thank you, see you next time. Goodbye, little doggy. Our next guest from the Dino Safari series, Danny McBones and assistant! <laughs> Glad to have you two here. Nice to be here. So what do you think is going to happen with Dino Safari next year? Well, to be honest, I'm not really sure because we haven't done an episode of Dino Safari in a long time. Sounds nice. Um, there's only one episode of Dino Safari. Do you think they'll have any more? Well, all the series are going to get updated. It's just like, which one's first? So if all of you viewers go ahead and vote on this poll up there in the corner, then that would be great. Sounds nice. Now, Assistant doesn't actually have his name mentioned in the episode. Does he have a name, or is there nothing? Well, after Danny McBones' name was thought up, we didn't have any cool names left, so we just decided not to mention his name at all, like in the Monster series. That's all we've got time for today. Have a really happy new year, and I'll see you guys in another Stickbot Kids movie. Thank you so much for watching.